Hi, I'll be right with you. Okay. Hi there, what can we get for you today? Can I please have a Venti Pike Peak coffee and then a birthday cake pop and that's it? All right, does the screen look correct for what you were wanting today? Yeah. Perfect, that will be 670 and we'll see you at the window. Okay, thanks. My husband said it was a Pike Peak, but it's Pike Place. Oh my gosh. He's like, what are you talking about? Hi there. how are you? Good, how are you? Okay, thank you. And there you are, thank water away. Have a good day. You too. So we just grabbed our Starbucks for the day and we are headed to Once Upon a Child because I'm signed up for their text message alerts whenever there's a sale or something going on. And they said today, Apparel is 30% off and if you sell a pair of shoes to them your name's gonna be put into a drawing for a hundred dollar gift card And I'm like why not but that's what we're doing right now I grabbed a whole bag full of Rosie's old shoes that she can't fit into anymore These are some of the shoes I'm getting rid of my sister actually got these for Rosie. They're Michael Kors These ones I got at TJ Maxx. I think there's like five pairs These I got from Walmart for only a dollar and she never even got to wear them. What else is in here? These little shoes, oh my gosh. She never even wore these either. So we'll see if these win me $100. I don't think we can get all those. <laughs> What'd you find? Those aren't your size though. Let's go look in your size. You want a cart? <laughs> Let's go find a cart. Alrighty, so they ended up taking four of the five pairs of shoes, which I can't complain about. Although I don't know why they didn't take this last pair. There's literally nothing wrong with them. Like the bottoms aren't torn up at all and she barely wore these. I think she only wore these like literally three times, but whatever. So they gave me like eight bucks, I think. But of course I found some stuff and I tried to limit how much I got cause she honestly doesn't really need any more clothes, but it's really hard for me to hold myself back because the clothes are so stinking cute. So I found this and I had to get it. Like it's pink, it still had the tags on it. How much was it originally? So originally it was $9.97 and I got it for $3.50. And then I just got one other thing. It's this cute little two-piece like track suit. It says princess in training. And then here are the pants. I love how the side has like the reflective strip on it. That's kind of cool. So I'm in my husband's car because his car is bigger than mine and there is bird crap all over it. So we're right next to crew car wash. So I'm gonna head over there and get all this bird poop washed off the car. I have this really cool Amazon find that I wanted to show you guys and it is super cool. I actually got two of them. They come in these like umbrella type cases and then you put your front mirrors down to hold it in place. Isn't that so cool? And it keeps your car from turning into an oven. I got one for the front of the car and then one for the back of the car. Okay guys, I'm gonna show you my New York and Company haul. I already opened one because I was so excited. These. Oh my gosh, so I saw these and I had never in my life had heels that had the little fluffy on the back, but as soon as I tried them on, I knew that from now on, this is like literally what I'm gonna be buying. Anything with the back that has like a little 
fluffy heel I'm definitely going to get. I will say though, these are just a little bit small if you have wide feet. They didn't have a wide selection, so definitely size up if you can. But this is what I'm most excited about. All the clothes are in here. So let's open this. And hopefully they fit because I have a lot of reels planned today that I wanna wear these for. I guess I should explain that first. So the magazine came out and I am going to Bloomington just to take a few reels for my official Miller Co. Um, Instagram page. And this is what I got all the clothes for. I got a red suit, a polka dot suit. And yeah, like I said, I hope all of this fits because today won't be ruined, but it'll just make it a lot harder. But this is the red suit that I got. Look at this. This is what they called a corset blazer, so I'm interested to see how this would fit. They only had it in a size 12 at the time, and actually now I think it's sold out. What's that? That's a blazer. And then luckily, they had the matching pants to fit. What size did they get? Okay, I got a size 10, and this did come in a petite and a tall, so I got mine in the tall size. Uh-oh, there's not a lot of stretch in here, so I don't know. Hopefully I got the right size, but we'll make it work if I didn't. <laughs> okay, and then the last thing I got is this black polka dot suit. This one I got for some reason in a medium, I don't know why. You Oh, I think on the website they said to size up. I mean size down, sorry. <laughs> so here's the blazer. And if you notice, the heels match these. Oh, I was so excited about that. And I'll show you guys what they look like on. And here are the pants. These ones, did I get a size tall? So they say 10 average. So 10 is what I usually wear, so. I thought I had another pair of pants. I'll have to check, but I thought I got another pair of polka dot pants. I'll have to check my order. Good morning my friends. So today we are up bright and early because we are going to see my grandmother Mimi, which is Rosie's great grandmother. We are going to Martinsville and we're going to be eating at this place called Come and Get It. Oh my lord, they have the best food. If you're ever traveling through Martinsville, definitely check this place out. I always get their hash browns and french toast and then a side of bacon and it is delicious. My grandmother has the tallest lily plants ever. I planted them in my yard as well and they're nowhere near as tall as these. Mimi also likes to keep a lot of really creepy dolls everywhere so we don't stay too long. I had to get out for a minute in nature just to clear my mind, so I decided to come to McCormick Creek. Oh my gosh, you gotta be careful on these stairs because they're so slick. But I took my daughter home, my husband's off work today, so she's napping, and I'm just gonna show you guys this really, really pretty waterfall. Also, I love my shirt. It says, I will not be remembered as the woman who kept her mouth shut. And I'll have it linked down below if you guys wanna check out the Instagram shop that I bought it from. I just thought it was a really cool message, so I got this shirt in both the white and black color because I just love the message so much.
The best part is having to walk up this super steep staircase to get back to the top. <laughs> oh, good lord. If I wasn't hot before, I definitely am now. Those stairs are so super steep, my goodness. So my husband texted me when I was out here and he said he wanted um, a big gulp, but I think I'm just gonna go to Taco Bell and get him lunch. Cause I had breakfast with Mimi and Rosie and he didn't have anything cause he didn't come with us. So I think I'm just gonna go to Taco Bell and pick him up some lunch. Um, can I go ahead and get the number four with a large Mountain Dew and then a side of chips and cheese? And that's it. Sauce? Uh, mild sauce, please. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Mission accomplished. I always get the same thing when I go to Taco Bell, so let me know, what's your favorite thing? Comment down below. All right, we made it home. My husband is outside weed whacking, so he didn't want his Taco Bell just yet, but I came home and my sister had sent me a package. Okay, what do we have? Oh, I see a coloring book, a Disney princess coloring book. Rosie's gonna love that. Oh my gosh, there's probably over 100 pages in that. Cute, love it. Oh my gosh, she got a lot of stuff in here. Oh look, a Gabby's dollhouse toy. That is so adorable. Oh my gosh, Rosie absolutely adores Gabby. I'll give this to her whenever she wakes up from her nap. I see a book, oh, this is for me. I love Dolly Parton. Which one is this? Dream more, celebrate the dreamer in you. Oh, that's cute. Oh my gosh. It's like a little vintage sailor outfit that every mom in the 90s would have their daughter wear. That is so adorable. Okay, that's cute. What is this? Ooh, this looks like a Love Shock fancy dress. Wow, what's the brand? Jonah Michelle. That is perfect for summer. Look at the colors on that. Oh, here's another cute little dress, or is this a jumpsuit? No, it's a dress. Seashells. Giving Little Mermaid vibes. This looks like a sweatshirt. Ooh, it's a Carhartt sweatshirt. Look at that. That looks brand new too. This is a little Christmas outfit. Ooh, and it still has the tags on it. Oh, this is cute. It's a little Christmas shirt with reindeer and snowman on it. Awesome. Okay, let's... Oh, I know what this is. This is a little cape that my sister found. Ooh, oh my lord, this is from Neiman Marcus. It still has the tags on it. It was $174, originally 232. Wow. I think that was in the way when I showed you this dress. Let me hold it up again. Here it is. It has little butterflies on it and this beautiful purple bow in the front. Okay, but then the last thing was the forgiveness journal which I love journaling, so this is really cool. I'm definitely gonna use this. Happy Friday, everybody. So today we are checking out this flea market, and I'll be honest, the better part of my day was spent inside in the air conditioning because where I live, it got up to the 90s, and I don't do well out in the heat. I'm an air conditioner girly all the way, so I spent the better part of my day inside in the air conditioning, but later on in the day, I definitely did check out the flea market and there was a lot of cool stuff. It was a lot of vintage like toys and things like that. So I always love walking around flea markets because you never know what you're gonna find.
I really love ending the day taking care of my fountain. It just gets me outside and in the fresh air. I love to water my plants, move the rocks around, and just overall make it look really nice. So that's what I'm doing here. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll catch you next time.